Welcome to Cloud Infrastructure Services YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to show you how you can set up or install GitLab Community Server on Ubuntu hosted on Google Cloud Platform. So, simply click the link in the description box to come to this marketplace listing for Google Cloud Platform and from here you want to create a new virtual machine. So for that, simply click on this button that says launch. After that, you would be brought to this page from where you can customize your virtual machine. So choose a deployment name. Choose the region where you want your virtual machine to be deployed. Scroll down, choose the machine type according to your requirements as well as the disk space according to your requirements. After that, go with the default network interfaces and then simply accept the agreement and click on deploy. And then you would have to wait for the deployment process to complete. Now once the deployment process is complete, the next step is to connect to the SSH terminal of your newly created virtual machine. So for that, simply click on this button that says SSH. And this is going to open up a new window which is going to take a few moments to connect to the SSH terminal of your virtual machine. Now once connected to the SSH terminal, you want to edit the configuration file. So for that type in the command sudo vim forward slash etc forward slash gitlab forward slash gitlab dot rb and then hit enter. So this is going to open up this configuration file. Now in this configuration file, you want to change this external URL to your domain or if you do not have a domain then you can simply change it to the IP address of your newly created virtual machine. So head back to Google Cloud Platform, click on this hamburger icon, scroll down and choose compute engines and then click on VM instances. Now on this page you can see this external IP address so copy this IP address, open up the SSH terminal and in this SSH terminal you want to press I to start inserting and then you are going to remove this URL. But you need to keep this http colon forward slash forward slash and then paste in our URL address. After that, simply press escape colon wq exclamation mark and hit enter. After that, what you want to do is that you want to run the configuration file once more. Now the command to run the reconfiguration is sudo gitlab hyphen ctl reconfigure and then hit enter. And then you need to wait for a little while for the reconfiguration to finish. Once the reconfiguration is complete, you can go back to your Google Cloud Platform and then simply copy the IP address, paste it inside a new tab and then hit enter to access your GitLab portal. Now if you see this 502 message, that means that the reconfiguration is still in process. So simply wait for a few moments and then reload your page. After a few moments and after refreshing the page, you would be brought to this particular page and from this page, it is asking you to type in the new password for the root user. So simply type in the password and confirm the new password and click on change your password. After that, it is going to ask you for your username to log in. Now the username is root and then the password that you just entered and then click on sign in. Now after that, you would be brought to this page. Now this is the GUI portal for GitLab. Now you can click on projects and create new projects and stuff like that, like simply do that. But that is up to your requirements and your use for GitLab. So one other thing that you can do is that you can simply click the link in the description box to come to this blog post and from here you can set up the SSL certificates for GitLab. So to do that simply open up your SSH terminal and let me just quickly place them side by side. So you are going to again open up the configuration file so that was sudo vim forward slash etc forward slash gitlab forward slash gitlab dot rb and then hit enter. And what you are going to do is that you are going to press i to enter the insert mode. And then you're going to copy these lines. So turn on the let's encrypt, then type in the contact information for your let's encrypt website. So contact me emails, then type in your email over here. So I'm going to type in admin at cis.com. And then you want to set a renew date for your SSL certificate. So these set of commands renew it every seventh day at 1230. So copy these commands and type them in. And then you want to hit escape colon wq and an exclamation mark and then hit enter and after that you want to rerun the configuration so that was sudo gitlab hyphen ctl space reconfigure and once the reconfiguration is done you would have successfully set up the ssl certificates for your gitlab virtual machine as well so that brings us to the end of this tutorial now if you have any queries regarding this tutorial make sure to leave that query in the comment section down below and we will get to you as soon as possible and make sure to check out the link in the description box for the marketplace listing for Google Cloud Platform 
and for the step by step blog post guide. And if this video has helped you in any way, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel.